Oh my god. <sighs> Stop. <gasps> Hey everybody, welcome in for Ever's Prime Time. I'm Ever, and today we are watching some more BoJack Horseman episodes seven and eight. And after the last one, I have no idea where this is gonna go, but I'm assuming at the very least, we're gonna go back to a normally formatted episode. If you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe so you can come back and watch the whole thing with me. And if you're interested in the uncut reactions, you can get access to that by becoming a patron with the links down below. Without anything else though, let's go ahead and get into it. Come on, what if you changed all the names and identifying characteristics? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, okay. that this would. This is a story mm -hmm. about <clears throat> Bo, 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 the angsty. Bo, Bo, the zebra. angsty zebra. Mm hmm. What a weird intro. <laughs> I, okay, so we're back to the regularly formatted episode. With... We are not back to the regularly formatted episode. Got it. Okay. <laughs> I love that they change literally everything. Bobo so it all the angst zebra. I was in a session with Diane. Da, Diana. Like Diana, Princess mm -hmm. of Wales. Yeah. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's just so Oh tough my god, this is gonna be like, so I dumb. Be <laughs> I don't know. Girl sounds young, right? <sighs> Whatever it is, it's gonna mm -hmm. be bad because very was, bad. Why? As some of you might have heard, my mom died recently. I know you're <laughs> okay. all very concerned. But so I we're not doing anything it different. It's just they're gonna I'm look here. different. And Got I'm it. doing fine. I just want to focus on the show. So please treat this like any other day and be extra nice to me because I am a famous <laughs> actor, not because my mom died. Mm-hmm. Thank yes. you. Good. Didn't, yes, didn't we I'm... just end with them like being impressed by him for doing his own stunt? Because they don't seem like they really care hey, now. Did you hear my mom died? Yeah, <laughs> but you don't want to talk about it. No. Pretty weird she died though, huh? Do you it is weird. The it? fact no, that like just there's saying, just a hole weird. now, like they're just gone, and we don't like we don't even really get resolution from that either. I feel like Flippy, are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> hey, what are we filming today? Why is there a submarine set? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Did you hear my mom? That is such a good job of changing the such a mood switch up between episodes. Uh. They also live together. Is that? Uh. Oh, what a oh morning. wait, 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 wait! Hold on. Is... If your story can have Princess Diana, why can't mine have Emperor Fingerface? It's not actually Princess Diana. <laughs> She's just named Diana. I've been picturing Princess Diana. Uh, okay, yeah, we've all been. Yes. Tell me what happened with Emperor Fingerface. Oh we lived God. In the same apartment as a tangled fog of pulsating yearning in the shape of a woman. Good morning, Emperor Fingerface. <laughs> Good morning to you, tangled fog of pulsating yearning. See you tonight. Afternoon. I want to talk to you, so I set a meeting through your assistant. Now, have you seen oh my keys? Oh my God. Butter in the fridge. I think I put this them there episode is so cursed. <laughs> I know you're a gal on the go, but even tangled fogs of pulsating yearning need to eat right. I'll get something on <sighs> Tangled set. fogs of pulsating uh -huh, yearning. I my face. I feel like I'm having a hard time following the story because that <laughs> yeah. weird you made. The These two have been living together for almost a year with virtually no drama. In some ways, that's, it's the most yeah. functional relationship either has ever been. <laughs> yeah, oh, that's, okay. it's I the most that's functional that relationship Wait, we have in the entire the show. The Just goes to show, you get what you need if you pull the right strings. Strings? Oh, it was you! What was me? The last string cheese in the <sighs> apartment. I was saving oh, and here's you the, took here's it. Here's the and drama. Now you right. want me to give you an office? What? I didn't take your cheese. Uh-oh. Are we having a work-related conflict? This feels like more of a you crashing on my couch related <laughs> conflict. When I started here, I signed a contract that said all intra-office disputes must be resolved via mediation or failing that. Forced arbitration. <laughs> So then I, well, you're not eating. It's just, I keep thinking about Bobo the zebra. This is the zebra. stupidest episode to have after the eulogy. Oh my god. Shoot, we'll shoot. Meanwhile, you want to go bang one out in your trailer? I'll get my diaphragm. Nah, I'd just be thinking about my dead mom the whole time, <laughs> which would either ruin it or, oh god, what if it makes it better? <laughs> I don't want to know that. You want me to god. just gain some pie? No. 
Yes. yes. Okay, big guy. <sighs> oh. Hey, buddy. Hey, Mr. Chocolate Hazelnut Spread. I'm really <laughs> sorry about your mom. No, it's fine. I'm fine. It's really fine. You must <laughs> Mr. Be so Chocolate Hazelnut Spread. One. I, for one, never have. You've never this lost a loved so one. This is so dumb. Oh, she moved to it's a some farm, weird alternate universe. It's almost like that Futurama episode where they, you know... Go into the box and they pull the box out of the different universe, the alternate universe and everything. It feels right though. So, a brief recapitulation. This is not a room for repudiation or condemnation over string cheese appropriation accusations. Mediation is an invitation for open conversation, frustration, de-escalation, and an exchange of information, which in summation removes any justification for litigation <laughs> I mean, this involving is, this is this exactly how PC Nobody talks was too, going so. to litigate anything. Yeah. I was excited to come home to some string cheese, the very last one. I've been saving it all week. <laughs> the music all week playing like the Wednesday? goofy whatever Todd talks is just goofy Thursday like circus Wednesday. music. Why would you even can't eat while I'm terrified? That's why I'll never know the delicious crunch of Count Chocula. Oh. That still doesn't mean I took it. You will both have a chance Come on. to Come on. <sighs> Todd is literally just an adult child. Like He's a child and an adult father. He's basically oh boy. God, what was the what was the kid's name in the first season that I Vincent? It's just Vincent, dude. Just without the trench coat. I, mean, I, I could never fathom. Mm. And that realization allows <laughs> me to forgive. Mm -hmm. Not for his sake, but for mine. Mm -hmm. Has he wow. never seen How was I talking? Therapist? I hope that was cathartic for you. He probably you come should back have. Same time tomorrow? Wait a minute. I see he should have. He should have probably done this a long time ago. My new best friend. Uh -huh. <sighs> oh, boy. Ugh, oh, I'm sorry. I feel like I'm hogging all the conversation. There's definitely more to your story than there is to mine. mine is <laughs> yeah, like there's a secondary story, a B story, if you I will. Love, I have a feeling I will love when writers to talk about the B story. My story gets increasingly so funny. Serious. Let's continue to switch <sighs> back and forth between our stories. Yeah, Pausing let's keep doing it, just like a regular moment. episode. That like the most natural mm -hmm. way to have a conversation. Well, while I was yeah. talking to Bobo, Diana. I don't was know. Like I obviously the A B story format works. Otherwise, not every single show would do it. But like I personally. Personally, I would rather just have a single plot going on and just be able to, you know, go along with that. But I also know that 20 minutes of animation is a lot for a single story. Now, as a friend, Dr. Indira is my new friend. No. What? It's great that you would want to talk to someone, and you should. But she's mine. I really need her to just be mine. Can you understand <laughs> that? Oh, yeah. no, Bojack cannot. No. <sighs> Diana asked me not to be friends mm -hmm. with you. So, out of respect for her, I think it's best that I continue seeing you behind her back. Um. We can still totally do our lunchtime <laughs> hangouts, but to cover our tracks, I'll compensate you for your time on the book so it looks like you're seeing a client. And just to be safe, we should invoke a therapist to friend confidentiality. How's that sound? So, in my dreams, I'm oh my Filbert, God. and sometimes when I wake up, I don't know if I'm. <laughs> so, Filbert we're not actually going to get to any roots still of any problem. Oh, we're that's just. Our time. Mm -hmm. A friendship hour. I'm just so glad it's not that the I same time. It's 3:29. The last time he was here. Babies with some entertaining lunchtime convo. My job is to listen, and at that moment, Bobo needed someone to listen. Bobo. I know the feeling. Okay, we've been going back and forth for two hours. Can we take a break? I gotta Honestly, though, if I even can, maybe anyone just hand down there. who yes, I'll find out. has to deal with anybody in our main cast of people, like these outside characters, God bless them for the patience in which they give our characters, because God, they don't deserve it. So, turns out I can use a bathroom, but it comes out in tiny cubes. Hey. I took the string cheese. Ha <laughs> ha! I knew it! <laughs> so she can replace the cheese and you'll give her an office. We did it! Great. Yay! Let me just grab my pen. But even if I did take the cheese... Uh, I mean, which you just admitted you did! Would I be in the wrong? I mean, it is kind of a fair game food, don't you think? What? Is it's not it? like it's a sandwich. Some foods are just widely understood to be up for grabs. No, no, okay. you guys? <laughs> well, then let's I mean, make a list of fair I don't game think foods. I necessarily fair disagree game. with that, Thanks. but fair I think I think that An also depends. Pie, not fair game. A sliced uh, pie, fair game. The last slice, not fair game. <laughs> well, let's the red on the hand. What's fair game to me in my apartment? Oh, that's right, everything. You literal knucklehead. Mm. Oh, that's a. Well, we were making good progress. We had past. no conflict Crazy for a whole too. year. Working through his process, and I am helping. Sounds good. Just remember, you are not responsible for the dysfunction of others. What? Uh, I'm just <laughs> saying, don't let him get you down. Where did you hear that about the dysfunction of others? I mean, he could have heard it the first session that they had, right? Mm. 
Hey, <sighs> are we gonna get new pages today or what? No, well, well, everybody should just go home. Princess Carolyn? I'm sorry, Priscilla Crustacean. Vominos on the pages, okay? I've been here all day today. Wednesday, October 24th, waiting for something to shoot. On delay, on delay, on delay. I think your Priscilla Crustacean <laughs> is the same. Knew it! Diana, let me explain. How long has he been your client? Not a client. Three sessions. Days. Friends for three days. I asked you not to see her. I asked for the one literal part of my life easiest that I thing that you could have done. Newsflash. Literally the easiest. Shit right now. Maybe if I could talk to you, I wouldn't need to be looking for other friends. Diana, is there anything you'd like to discuss with Bobo? We can do it right <laughs> here. This is a safe space. No, this doesn't yeah, you feel can do like a, a safe group space therapy. anymore. I can't keep coming here. Yeah, that's actually, yeah, him. that's fair. Then it sounds like our time together is done. What? The fact that you're setting a boundary Shh. is good. Go forth with the tools I've given you. Live oh. your life, Diana. Like okay, I mean, win. yeah, Hopefully that's, yeah. I think Bobo needs me more. Would you like validation? <laughs> no, your validation is worthless to me now. You two deserve <laughs> each other. But at least now you can help the angsty zebra, right? Well, no, okay. nobody can help now the angsty zebra. And again. now that what Diane is gone, he has no interest in participating in this. And now comes the even harder <sighs> part: getting the help. Let's he doesn't, talk about he doesn't your actually, You know what? Yeah. This has been great. I got yeah. what I wanted and I made No, it doesn't progress, matter so now. I think I'm done. Yeah. Yes, you did it. Uh, you changed my stripes. Dr. Indira, uh, you're great at your job. Goodbye forever. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> I can't believe yeah. I lost two Immediately. clients in one day. She was not home when the cheese went missing, rendering <laughs> any arbitration agreement made under those conditions null and void. Whoa. Thanks a lot, Mary Beth. Does Just that really job, help kid. the situation, Dr. though? Dr. I mean, like, the lines are already drawn. Does it matter? Jessica Chastain says no to, and Mary They were doing so media. good, too. That's so dumb. They were doing so good. No fighting. I guess I just wanted it to be a workplace dispute because I thought if you knew it was a roommate dispute, you might kick me out. I'm not going to kick you Aww. out. I like having you around. Oh, Really? Who else would I get to keep my keys cold? Well, you know, <laughs> I have this job now. Maybe I could start paying, I believe it's pronounced rent. Rent? Well, that's a great idea. That's, but yeah. I also need my own space, which is why I wanted that office. Well, then, let's get you that office. Oh, okay. So that's, again, we go back to them at least. Hey! Oh. Of course it was in his pocket, though. I mean, of hey. course. I probably could have called that from the second that arbitration started, but... Yeah, I'm not someone therapy works on. I might be too smart. Oh, my God. <sighs> you haven't changed at all. Whoa, 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 Diane. No, no, no. no. I'm not the problem here. None no. of this would have happened if I felt like I could talk to you, my friend, after my mother died. So would you like to talk about your mother? No, I'm just saying as an example. Why do you keep bringing things back to my mother? <laughs> Her face. <laughs> Dude, you yeah, say, it's literally, it's just an ongoing thing. Well, he Dira, she said we don't need her. She said I don't need her. I know, but you're just as screwed up as I am, so if I am not as that's screwed not up even as you are. Man, that's not me. even Come on. We're the same. <gasps> no. We are not the same. I don't think so. <gasps> right? Oh god, oh, what are you? That's good stuff. We're doing it, Diane. <laughs> We're doing it. <laughs> Dude, her face. I no, they're not the same. So I mean, they're week. both Losing bad, it. not great people, but like Definitely not the same. And, oh my god, my dad is dead! Oh. Cheer up, everyone. <sighs> we got new pages. All right! Okay, we're gonna film in the living room with Filbert and Sassy Malone first. Oh then we're moving god, into the here submarine we go. for the flashback. No <laughs> here we go, dude. We gotta... Things got out of hand. Hey, who do you work for? Well, I sure as hell don't work for tips. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, hey, Brent, be cool. Be cool. We are in a sure <laughs> submarine. Only there was no... Stuff. Oh my god. There was a girl there. She couldn't have been older than 17. Oh, Bring god. in the girl. What? Oh, what is god. this? Keep going. We gotta oh, get this Oh my god. <sighs> they were smuggling drugs. They were smuggling drugs. Hey, are you okay? <coughs> I'm fine. Just do this. <coughs> I told her it was going to be okay. <laughs> oh god. She kissed me. What? What did you do to her, Filbert? Nothing. Like I said, she kissed me. Kiss her back. What? We need to get you kissing her back. What? Kiss me, you idiot. Kiss her! <laughs> this whole thing is gonna blow. We gotta bounce, friendo. If Fritz hadn't come for you, what would you have done with the girl? Part of me is sure I couldn't go through with it, but another part knows that's a lie. We, <laughs> we can't just leave her here. Use your brain, Filbert. Malone, Dude. you gotta believe me. I'm a good guy. <laughs> if I'd known shit. she was there, I never would have. Tell me what happened. I'll be back. Horrendous. Be right Come on, lover boy. You can't. 
kissed a young girl and then left her to die. I'm a good guy. I didn't know that she was... You have to understand, I'm a good guy. She trusted you. How do you make something right when you've made it so wrong? You can never go back. Oh, How did you come up with all God. That? It's a story I heard once. I just changed all the <laughs> Yeah. I'll never forget that night on the USS New Mexico. <laughs> it's just good to have someone to talk to. Cut. Amazing. I'm a genius. That was perfect. Oh my god, dude. The way that that just came together. Will Bojack actually do anything about it? Who knows? But that was literally perfect. Yes. I am so excited to go to a real Hollywood party with my husband. She seems so unjaded. Just do me a favor. Compared to when we see her. Okay. Now hurry up and finish getting ready. Okay. Never mind. Can you imagine if I spoke to you like that? I really can't. Next time we're doing a couple's costume, though. It's the perfect. I just know you're afraid of mummies, and since it's Halloween, we might see some mummies. I'm not afraid of mummies. I just don't like them. Because of an incident <laughs> because, from my past. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Will you stay on the lookout and keep those Do we get to see the, the past or I'll no? Be sure to make a You're the guy from The Hangover, the first one, which just came out this year. I don't mm. know why I said first one, because there's only one Hangover movie, and it's 2009. Yeah, there's and only one. Is there, isn't there like four Barbie now? Bjorn. Borg. It's too many. Famous 70s tennis player. And what's with the Ooh. robot stuff? Borg from Star Trek. And you're also a baby? In The Hangover, the guy had a baby Bjorn. Baby why? Bjorn Borg. Why? <laughs> Dude, he's Seems so like good. He does not. Anyway, he does not get it at all. Every Halloween party I went to with one of my ex-wives, we'd get in a huge blowout. I am so. so why would you third time? Third time's the charm. Going, so is that? No that yeah, Diane is very easygoing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Believe you me, this party. Oh my is going God, to be are we going to be switching booyah. between all of this bowl? Oh boy. Oh, and this is going to be the best Halloween ever. <laughs> oh. I mean, it's sweet that he tries every time, I guess, right? Oh, the party wow, is at Bojack's. Very fancy Hollywood party. I'm ready for my close up. Nice. Sunset Boulevard. I've tried so hard not to like speak of it. Bojack must really but love Pickles, Halloween. Like, he has this big <sighs> it's just so stupid. <laughs> like it just looks so foul. Why are you at my house? Remember <laughs> I invited you to my Halloween party and you said you'd love to come, but you couldn't because you were having your own Halloween party? Oh, right. Well, I'm sure my yeah? guest will show up any minute, so you should probably oh, go. Oh, God. Well, I figured, hey, why not have a crossover <laughs> party? So I brought my party, wait for it, to you. That oh. was the first ever wait for well, it. That's... It's 1993. Uh... Come on in, guys. God damn it, why are you here? <laughs> so was there ever, like, party, maybe in the in the newest one with Pickles, maybe Bojack finally hosted the party no, on his own? See. So suddenly we're having a party? Why didn't you tell me this was happening? Because I hate that it happens. I take no action that it happens. <laughs> Hopes if he doesn't think about it, it happen, won't happen. And it keeps happening anyway. Well, <laughs> I feel like an idiot being at a Halloween party without a costume. Who cares? I don't have a costume. Uh, you're wearing a costume. Do you mean in the sense that we all wear costumes every day, such as we reveal facets no, of ourselves you're, to those no, closest you're, to us, but our truest selves <sighs> remain hidden? No, in the sense that you are literally wearing a costume from the TV show we both work on. Oh, yeah. I'm going to Rite Aid to see what I can throw together. Don't let the party die down before I get oh, back. Oh, I actually like Gina. She seems kind of chill. Why grip a Twix when you can sip a Wits? What? I don't just keep answering the door until I tell you to stop. You got it, Chief. Dude, the goggles. <laughs> like, she's Diane, a... She's dressed as Amelia Earhart. Oh, my mean? God. Well, I got it. I got it. We got there. We got there. It took a second, but we're there. We're also dressed as Amelia Earhart, I guess, post-crash. Judging on their ripped clothes. Oh no! Why did I give you the option of trick <laughs> or treat? I just want a treat. Oh Come back God. when you're five years older or three years younger. How about now? Okay. <laughs> Come on in. Whoa. Cool house. Oh God. Oh, thank you. It's not mine. It's my boyfriend's. Really? Mm -hmm. Why does he make you answer the door? No, <laughs> he doesn't make me. He 
Oh my god, you're right. What am I doing? What am I doing with my life? Oh, <laughs> uh, well, judging by your outfit, I'd say you're a pilot of some sort. I moved to LA when I was 18, and now I'm 35. Everything's Time's happening so fast. Yeah, oh, no. it's ticking, baby. I'm 18. Am I going to be 35 soon? That's when they make you president. I don't want that. That's too much responsibility. I can't do this anymore. You, take my Wouldn't shot. shock me if that eventually happened. Absolutely wouldn't shock me. Okay, this cider has not been sufficiently alcoholed. If I'm trapped here with all you losers, Jesus I'm at least Christ. getting drunk. <laughs> That's a lot. Whoa, God, I think somebody spiked the cider. <laughs> well, I guess one drink won't hurt. <laughs> no, I get that it's the oh, X-Files. I'm just saying. So innocent. <laughs> w Erica doesn't know anybody else at this party. It would be rude to leave her all by herself. Well, can I at least come with you? You know Erica can't talk to two people at once <laughs> on account of her split brain procedure. Why don't you go talk to, uh, the teacher from Ferris Bueller's Day Off? <laughs> what? Ben Stein? I'll bet that famously boring man is a blast at parties. I'll be right back. No, don't. Erica, love the costume. Where did you find such a hideous... Oh, my mistake. I'm so sorry. Ah. <sighs> The, the, the sure fighting begins. Idea, 13 year old? I have to ask, what is the deal with this mummy thing? Yeah, okay. please. Yes. I audition for the mummy. Aww. The one with Brendan Fraser. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I thought everything was going well. And then something really traumatic happened. Yes. Oh God, and what? what was that? I, uh, I didn't get the part. That's it. You just didn't Trouble! Really it. Yeah. And it mm -hmm. still haunts me. It's I guess that's what their fight is about that PB doesn't do think that. this is a big deal. Which. It really oh, isn't. Wives? Oh yeah, man! You brought so many wives and girlfriends <laughs> to these parties, I cannot keep track. Well, don't forget about pickles, huh? Uh, what? Why is the waitress here talking about pickles? <laughs> Somebody order pickles? No, Bojack. This is my girlfriend. Her name is Pickles. You can remember because if you look at me and don't recall my name, you'll think to yourself, "Who is this person? I'm in a real pickle." And then just know that my name is like the thing that you're in, but with an S at the end. <sighs> what? Oh, pickles. I'm pickles. My last name is a plenty. Do I need to know this one? Is she gonna be around for a while? <laughs> That's so terrible. I like that you're Do I need to know this one? If he teases you, that means he likes you. Yeah. What? Is that what people think when I tease them? Sure. It sounds like you all have a lot of history. Yeah, I can't believe we've been doing this party since 93. That's the That's year I was born. Yeah. I did not realize that. <laughs> that is Cheers. a little... Oh, uh, are you having fun? Yeah, I'm having a great time explaining my costume to people over and over again. <laughs> hey, here's a thought. If you don't get someone's costume, you don't need to tell them. Just live your life. Or you could just, no, you know, no, no, no. not fun. mix five different things together in a costume. That would be a strat leave. as well. And there's no reason we should be awkward around each other or jealous, you know? I'm not jealous of you. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm not jealous of you either, even though you are. <laughs> Really intimidating. Is she intimidating we though. Like, would we really call Diane so intimidating? Totally cool. Should we do shots together to like celebrate how normal we're being? <laughs> yeah, this is a good situation. <laughs> yeah. Okay, bye, Diane. Bye. Just yeah, just take Todd's just Hummer and get no, the hell out of there. No, that's not fair. She used to be fun. In fact, when we first started dating, my favorite thing about <laughs> was that she was so much more fun than my other ex wife <laughs> Oh, oh God. I know, somebody mentioned that's that we'd Jeffy. see them, like, throughout, but, like, this is the first time I remember actually seeing them in a hot oh minute. My God, what a weird coincidence. Why do <laughs> all these Mr. PB rooting. women <laughs> eventually turn bitter and cruel after being with me? What's the common denominator? <laughs> He's close. He's getting there. What? But this party is so fun. It's not fun for me. Because I don't know anyone here. Oh. Of course you do. Just uh, Bojack, you remember my wife Katrina? Huh? No, I do not. This is <laughs> oh you. no. You two chatted up. Where's no, the common people, denominator, please. Bojack? Oh God. Thank you for hosting this party. So fun. What's the story on the hat? It's a blossom costume. Oh shit, that's right. It's Halloween. I need a costume. Good call, stranger. Uh. <laughs> Dude, no, it's Bojack. He's the common denominator. Parties. Talk right now. Can I call you tomorrow? Or is this the one night a year you emerge from your crypt? <laughs> Go introduce yourself. I'm sure I, you I still can't you. get over the fact that she's just dead and we have no resolution or anything on that. Like, they just threw it away. Not threw it away, but they just like, ugh, it's just crazy, dude. You want to talk about it? Yeah, talk. Do it. No. Okay, let's we'll put that in the large bucket of things we don't talk about. What the hell is that <laughs> it's supposed to be? Thought you didn't want to talk about. <laughs> oh god. Oh, it's a big bucket though. It's a very, very big bucket. Oh, 
a dead soul told me to Eric Six Fasp. What could it mean? Cool. While you were gone, Ben Stein introduced me to Tim Allen, and the three of us had a long debate about government spending, which is exactly how I wanted to spend yes, my Yes, that's super fun so at a party. Mm -hmm, Although I mm -hmm. have to say, now that your TV show has put us into a new tax bracket, maybe we should start paying attention more to how the government is using our money. What? No, I don't know. You know oh, I'm just God, saying is that this a true capitalist <laughs> free market. This is where... <laughs> oh, God. Tim Allen? You left me alone for an hour and a half. I guess time flies when you're having fun, right? I am <laughs> having fun! Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hold um, that, and I'll circle uh, around you, here. Oh, no, no, okay, stay. No, I, get I love that, that he knows the party's gonna happen every that, year. Asks for a costume, right? but oh. never prepares to have the costume. <gasps> oh! That's terrible. <laughs> The music Diane is perfect. recorded by Tina Turner, but popularized by Ace of Base because don't turn around. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Horrifying, traumatizing. What do you mean a duel? You mean like like a duel? A duel? <clears throat> Hold on, somebody's <laughs> Eddie Bjorn Borg. Oh my God! Yes. Cute. What do you want? Oh, um, uh. I actually wanted to introduce yourself. I mean. Myself, <laughs> obviously, you already know yourself. So, <laughs> oh god! Oh Listen, my god! I just wanted to tell you how much I love this. Horses this is around. not how she it was, was like, like when we first met her. I feel like part of my childhood. So, like not Thank this you. awkward. Uh, sorry. Oh. Yeah, Mom, I'm still here. No, it was nobody important. Oh. oh, I get that it's a Glee club, but why are they singing when they're not in the Glee club? Where's the music coming from? Doesn't seem realistic. Why did you make me talk to Bojack? I'm <laughs> a complete fool of myself. No. I can't do it. He at least knew your costume, so though. I mean, like, that's pretty, that's pretty big. Boards, but I hate big parties. What? No. no. Yes, and I didn't want to tell you because I know how much this party means to you, but I can't be Didn't they start dating after pressure. Bojack, like, hired her to write... Did they did they change the timeline of how all that happened? Because that's what it feels like, but I'm not a hundred percent sure. I feel like you have to be fun. But I am fun. It has nothing <laughs> to do with you or your ex-wives or your ex-wife Diane, who is in this room right now. <laughs> oh, okay, God. now I'm looking for the owner of a blue Tesla, a red Maserati, and a gold helicopter. Let's just get out of here. <laughs> I don't want to get out of here. I'm having fun. This is fun for me. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> What's up with the waitress? You left me alone all night long. Let's see the I fallout. So yeah. I little want to be alone. So have fun hanging out with all your hippie liberal friends. Okay, <laughs> oh, I'm going my God. Go, go. Uh, oh, party's over. All right, fine. Let's make this an annual thing, though, okay? Well, I want to see all of you back here next year. No matter what. I asked you to do one thing, keep me away from mummies, and you couldn't uh, even do that. Okay, in my defense, I am dressed <laughs> like a giant book, outfit. which severely limits my mobility. Well, how do you think I felt when I had to do that screen test all wrapped up in gauze? Wait, you were auditioning to play the mummy? Mom, I, I, I gotta go. Okay, I'll, I'll call you tomorrow. Yeah, we will figure out Dad's funeral. And I'm... I'm sorry. Huh. Wow! Boy, what's going on? I think Boy. the party's over, sir. You know, I always thought that when this happened, I would feel something. I don't know what, but something. But I don't feel anything. What's wrong with me? Nothing's wrong. Just sometimes parties are over. <laughs> different, different party Bojack's talking about. But hey, it, it doesn't. I can't believe his dad over. died in a I mean, duel by cracking his head on a, a on a rock. Bit. Yeah, sure. So Good idea. dumb. Stick around for as long as you want. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I feel like they have retconned some things, but I'd have to go back and watch the first season to remember fully. I really humiliated myself in front of Bojack. If it makes you feel any better, I guarantee Bojack won't even remember <laughs> that he met you. Oh! That makes it make That's a good... Okay, new strategy. Uh, I'm looking for four strong... Shout out to the writers. That is a good... I love that. That's great. Oh, what's going on in there? 
tough SAT prep course. <laughs> Failed learner's permit test. Okay. Skirmished with the other members of the Babysitters Club. Not at all. Shattered dreams of playing Adelaide in her high school's production of Guys and Dolls because the musical director sees her as more of a rest God. of Charlie. God damn, oh, Diane. What's happening? I take these amazing women like Pickles, like you, Katrina, Jessica, and I ruin them. Uh, I'm not ruined. <laughs> no, I just mean, I don't listen. Okay. Yes, it is definitely very annoying how you don't listen. Thank you, but you don't have to say nice things just to make me feel better. Huh? Okay, no. I was going <sighs> to say you not listening, and I repeat, you don't listen? That's not the only thing going on here. There are more things? What There's a lot of things. Comments? They're mean? When you first start dating them. They're fun? They're young. You keep dating women in their 20s. Oh, no, no dude. He's the Leonardo DiCaprio. <laughs> How do I fix that? Well, either you date someone older. Or. Or <laughs> you grow up. Because otherwise, they're going to keep outgrowing you. Mind if I try? Oh. Okay. First thing we need to do is sit you up and get you hydrated. Thanks. <laughs> the little I lick. What you're going through. I've been in your position <sighs> before, and this party is hard. It is. If, what if I'm just a rebound? Mm, I was a rebound, and he loved me so much for ten years. If there's one thing I know about that guy, it's that he is the person he's Wait. with deeply and unconditionally. What? So you don't have to worry about this, me because I'm not that. Has this anymore. show been going? Like, yeah. is the timeline for this show ten years, or did Bojack meet her ten years ago and completely like forgot? That is confusing the shit out of me, and I don't know if it's just because my brain is off or what. But if somebody can clarify that point, I got the best version of you. <laughs> That's right, version. Four Have they been out? together for ten years? They just got married at the beginning of like season one. Has this show? No way. Condense this time into 10 years? Like that much time has passed? Shindig up in NoHo. Who's Afeen's ex what now? They have a two-story ice luge and a huge beer pong tournament. My mom, I, I can't even process that, honestly. I genuinely can't pictures. process that. <laughs> I never want to grow <sighs> up. <sighs> Where's everybody going? It's Halloween. <laughs> 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 Happy Halloween. What Oh. Uh, where is everyone? Hey, let's do this again next year. I'm going to bed. <laughs> I love Halloween. Uh, before I get off into the, the, you know, talking of the episodes, if somebody can clarify, I was gonna Google it. I started Googling it, and just, like, the autocomplete stuff scared me, and I don't want to spoil Like, we're so close to the end, and I'd be pissed if I spoiled anything for myself at this point, but... I need clarification on the timelines here, or if they retconned, or if they just were very, very smart in how they wrote it and how he forgot about Diane. But that seems so crazy that, like, from season one to now would have been ten years. That just seems, like, very, very much. But anyway, the first episode was absolutely fantastic. I will say it started off much slower, but the way they built towards the ending there was absolutely crazy. I wish that there was more of a fallout, though. I wish that that was, like, the middle of the episode that that happened, and then we got to see, you know, some fallout from it. But it seems like we're just going to be tucking it away, and we're just going to keep letting that build for a while, which is disappointing, but... <sighs> I trust the writers at this point, right? We're like, we're, we're almost at the end. I can't not trust them. So I'm sure it'll come back. I'm sure it'll be fantastic as a solid, probably four out of five star episode. It was goofy. It had great story. It had a great ending. Very, very enjoyable. Totally rewatchable. The next episode, also very enjoyable. A little bit confusing with like the back and forth between the different times and everything, but a very, very fun. And I'm going to say mostly inconsequential episode again. I feel like this season, in so far like we're halfway through it has definitely had more inconsequential episodes than previous ones and i use the word inconsequential very loosely because i understand that this show like it's building towards something very obviously but some of the episodes in this season have just felt a little bit narratively weaker in some ways that might be a hot take. I don't know, but that's just how I'm feeling about it right now. It's definitely like it has some fantastic moments, and I'm sure that at the end of the season, the payoff's gonna be huge. But I just feel like it's not has been not as strong as season four, at least. And maybe that's the issue is that I watched season four so recently that it's like still in my brain and I'm just comparing it. But solid, solid episode. Another four out of five for me. Something I would definitely rewatch, but probably not like rewatch it over and over. 
Let me know what you guys are thinking about the season. I would absolutely love to hear it. Like I said, we're like halfway through, so now's the perfect time. Let me know how you feel about season, uh, season five, all that good stuff. If you guys enjoy the video and you'd like to come back, don't forget to subscribe so that you can do that. And if you're interested in the uncut reactions or getting early access to them, you can get access to that by becoming a patron or a YouTube member with the links down below. But until next time, thanks for watching.